to Fire Lord's Cove, everybody. We got an awesome little showing here. It's actually going to be a little special unboxing. As you can see, I got all the treasures already laid out. Every single one of these is going into a brand new design, and it's actually what we're calling our Pirate, Pirate Cash Trifold. Now, I've been kind of sneak peeking this a little bit because I've been trying to figure out all the unboxing stuff I've been wanting to do. But here's this little luxury beauty here. Now, oddly enough, um, if everybody's curious, this is an actual natural suede. And then on top of that, we made sure to use a proper, what you would say, horween leather. That way we can get this beautiful blue coming in for it. Now, I am trying to span it out. Forgive me on that with the camera there. Here we actually got a place to hold, like, the hanks. That's like any kind of style you all are trying to do. I have a couple here just so I can show it off. What's nice is you can either do one or you can do two. That's going to be one of the major advantages to this. It'll allow you to actually hold your hank in here if you're trying to do certain photos and stuff. Stack it right in. Next thing you got is coins. Now, what I wanted to do here was show you all a little trick. Because when me and the creator were talking about this, we wanted an option that could fit entirely different stuff. So, we measured out all kinds of variety of things here. That way I can give you all a great idea on it. So, Zippo lighter, you want that to fit, that is not a problem. Forgive me, this is kind of new, so we will be stretching out some of this a little bit. And, let's get that puppy in there. There we go. Next thing we got... Lati coin. I've had some people ask if it'll actually hold that. We're going to get that stretched out today for it. There we go. And then coins. The largest one I have, small and medium. Let's get those going. Now, this is the creator of the actual uh, Pirate Cash. This is Black Flag EDC. This is his first co coin out of brass. One of my favorite ones out of the whole entire set. It I carry this one with me every single day. The next one we have is by the Medford guy. It's to represent his uh, pirate coming to the pirate side. So we actually have our pirate plunder coin. This one's made out of 925 silver. And it's about the largest one that I got here. Now I asked Black Flag to make it where... Yep. And then slide that one in there. And we can slide that one in there. Perfect. Now, we got that taken care of. Let's see here. I wanted to do a couple specialty tools. It's probably where we're going to have to play around with the idea a little bit. Yep, going to have to probably adjust a little bit. Probably move a coin there, slide that there. Either way, it'll fit. I just got to break in the leather. It's still really tight. But that's common with it. Now that we got that side filled, let's check out here. Got that for the notebook. Pocket right there for it. Black flag, that was a great idea. Next is the knives. And of course you got the pen. Can't forget that. Okie dokie. Got the pen on the side there. Next we got is going to be the knife slots. Now these here, I actually asked Black Flag to measure it for a Medford. So that way we can get them to go in. Yep, just got to stretch it out. Alright. Let's see if we can actually get away without knocking off everything. So that one I am going to have to stretch. This is the micro. So now we can see if that's going to fit. Perfect, it will. So there we go. So I'll actually have to stretch those two out and get it set up with everything. But I at least wanted to give you guys a quick view of what everything it can hold because you can do anything you want with this. You're talking about if you wanted your tools just to go in here for it, you can. Flashlights the same way. You can do anything you wish with it. That's kind of the whole route of going with the trifold, so that way you can maximize it the way you wanted it to. That way you get the biggest advantage out of it, and then on top of it, you get to close it all up. All right. 
and uh, let's see here. Now, folks, if you want different colors, the blue and the white was my contrast. I will give you a heads up. If you're a clean person, go for the white. If you're not, don't do it. Because I've already messed this up once. So, and I did not like doing that. But at the end of the day, it happens. It's going to get its patina. But now, let's see here. I'm going to actually rearrange a couple things here. Because then, that's the best part. You can do multiple things if you want. So you just want the pin there. Watch your flashlight. There we go. All in. Okay, best thing is, I already got my notebook right there. Fold over, fold over, and fold over. What I love about this thing is that you can actually just tie it off around and not have any problems with it whatsoever. And that gives you the major advantage. So you can adjust the size however you wish. You can make it however you wish to design it with it. The key things to it is that it's going to hold about anything you can think of. Knives, pocket knives, coins, you name it. It's got it. Now what I am going to do is get it stretched out. So this is not the only unboxing you're getting for this. Because right now it is practically brand new and I need to put everything in it to get it stretched. So... But other than that, folks, I wanted to give you a little quick unboxing. I hope you stay tuned for more because i got a bunch more items to show off. If you have any questions about the items that we have here today, I am going to be doing an unboxing for each one and then showing off the creator page. I hope all of you have a wonderful week, and I hope to see you again over at Pyrelord's Cove. Have a good one.